two kinds of people that make this kind of claim. There are people who truly believe it and are ignorant because they don't know any better. And then there are people who make them because they're slick con men trying to take advantage of people's desires and needs. Hi, I'm Christina Broderick, and this is my father, Dr. Jeffrey Broderick. We are asking for $300,000 for 15% of our company. I developed these products to extend the lives of pets by 50%. These products save people and pet owners tremendous amounts of money by keeping their pet healthy and disease free. How long have no. you been giving this product to no. your, your patients? Over a quarter of a century. Wait a minute, why are we feeding that to a dog? What about me? Yeah, it's the same thing. Will it work on people? This is human grade. This people is... can eat this. He does. I make a smoothie every morning and I dump it in the smoothie. You put this in your food, you'll be around to play with all the money that you're making. What is it, a supplement that I put into the pet food? It's a supplement that makes the food wild again. It brings nature back into the food. It brings the food wild again, I love that. Does it taste good? Take a taste. Yeah, like have a bite. Right now. <laughs> Am I going to live forever if I eat that? You oh, might. Can I hold the dog? Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> no. Oh, that stinks, man. Don't do it. Oh, oh my goodness. Can I hold the dog? Wow. Now? Ouch. Right. Not bad. Bring one of those over here, please. What does it taste like? You know, it's a little funky, but I... what's in it, Jeffrey? There are antioxidants, and there are all kinds of herbs from all over the world. How did you come up with this? I have researched in the last 40 years all over the world to bring this to fruition. They come from the longest living people on the planet. And you patent this? I'm not even certain. We didn't patent it because if you make out a patent, you gotta disclose everything that's in it. And we don't wanna make it so that it can be duplicated. And people have tried to duplicate it, and they cannot. Can you make the claim that Fluffy lasts 50% longer, or do you have to back that up with clinical data? Well, it's, it's my observation over 40 years. This cat is Rocky. But Jeffrey. Rocky's 24 years old, lives in Colorado. 24? Jeffrey, hang on a sec. I just want to be very clear because I want to see if this is a fun idea or if there is an element of um, quackery. Are you suggesting that, Robert? Well, snake oil, oil salesman about it. Why do, why do animals die? They die and they pass away for the same reasons as human beings. They disease. die of heart disease, kidney disease, liver disease, cancer. Right. Are you saying, very simple, that your product cures disease and cancer in pets? In my world, the Federal Trade Commission will make you prove that. Do you have a proof? I've been a veterinary surgeon for over 40 years. In that 40 years, I have seen every disease imaginable vanish from my practice. There's only two kinds of people that make this kind of claim. There are people who truly believe it and are ignorant because they don't know any better. And then there are people who make them because they're slick con men trying to take advantage of people's desires and needs. Or there's a vet that's had experience feeding this to dogs that have lasted a long time. Is he in that category? Maybe his claim is true, Robert. I find it almost offensive that he's claiming he can beat cancer for people's pets. He didn't say beat cancer. Did sure you say he... beat no. cancer? No, not beat, not cure, prevent. You but Jeffrey, you realize that in a society where 50% of all of us will probably get cancer in our older age, why I'm being very skeptical about your fantastic claim. Of course you're being skeptical because you were led to believe that you're gonna die of cancer or heart disease. And you've discovered the ability for me not to do that by taking this. Exactly. I discovered the ability for me not to get it, for you not to get it, and your pet not to Jeffrey, get it. if that's true, why the hell are we selling pet food? Why aren't you in a real hospital getting funding from people and saving humankind? Maybe why are we, we wasting our time selling pet food when you can cure cancer? Because the animals are my children. That's why. I'm out. I personally believe your story. The challenge is marketing this stuff. All we can say is this stuff looks like it works. But we can't make the claim because there's no study supporting it. For that reason, I'm out.